Hey guys, welcome back. Let's get the intro going and uh, we'll get right into this. All right guys, let me tell you a little bit about what's going on. As you know, here in Louisiana, we were hit with Hurricane Laura. That's why I haven't been on. I was out of uh, electricity for a little over a week and out of internet a little longer than that. So with that being said, it was a cat one when it hit us. We were the second worst parish in the state as far as damage. Um, this Washtenaw Parish, which is up north Louisiana, is still a category one when it hit us. So sign damage, stuff like that, it's kept me pretty busy. I'm tired, I'm extremely, extremely wore out. Uh, we're finally getting caught up a little bit. Now we move forward, you know, doing these videos and stuff for you, which is really good because we need to because there's a lot going on especially in the RTX stuff. Um, as of the 16th, uh, later today, the embargo is supposed to lift for everybody to let go of the specs and the set and other, you know, reviews of the cards. The thing is, everybody is selling their 2080s and their 2000 series cards. Don't. Uh, what people don't understand is they're bringing the, uh, the storage stuff to them cards that the 30s have. Your cards are still relevant. Them cards, are they're gonna get a boost. So, I, I cannot confirm whether I've seen the numbers or not. The 3080 is a beast of a card. I, flat out, I, I, cannot, I cannot say numbers because the people I know are, you know, by embargo, they, they, I, they're restricted. So I cannot physically tell y'all guys numbers. The, the thing I can tell you is that is a beast of a card. But with them bringing the direct storage, you know, communications to the 20s, uh, guys, don't jump on the bandwagon of selling them cards just yet. Guys that are selling them for $500 on eBay and, face, and Facebook and Craigslist and everywhere, don't. If you were lucky enough to pick one of them up for five, five fifty great you're gonna enjoy that car because of what's coming um yeah i know i got a weird thing sitting over here we'll get on that in a second but this this car this 3080 is gonna be in numbers that has been shown already the the 2080 ti flat out uh but is it worth the upgrade not if you already have a 2080 ti don't upgrade wait I'm telling you now, wait. There is another card coming. About two months out after the launch of this one, maybe two and a half. Uh, it is, it's rumored, but I know more than rumors sometimes. Sometimes I don't, so you can take that with a grain of salt, take it whichever way you want. The 3080 Ti is gonna be a 20 gigabit card, 20 gig card, whereas the 3080 is a 10 gig. Wait. I'm telling you, wait, don't upgrade from a 2080 to a 3080 because it's better. Wait, save your money and wait. It's gonna be worth it, trust me. Uh, I'm told you this now, if you do upgrade to the 3080, you're gonna be upset again in two or three months. So, that being said, guys, y'all, y'all, the, the bandwagon of the 30 series cars is a true thing. Uh, and there's a good reason for it. This card is gonna be a beast. Uh, it's probably gonna sell out pretty quick. So if you've sold your 2080 get plans to get this card, you may be sitting and waiting. Uh, just just letting you know, it may, you may be sitting and waiting. Now, that I got all that stuff out of the way, this big behemoth sitting here is fixing to be given away. Um, I'm gonna give it away to somebody in the United States this is an Ames inverter, 2,000 watt with a 6,000 watt spike uh, surge, if you want to call it that. It very little use on it. Is mine personally? I used it, uh, but but this is a 48 volt. But the thing is, I don't use it anymore. Uh, we lost power. Uh, I've used it for a little while. We moved in this building and never got hooked back up. But we lost power during the hurricane, Laura and I had to have a way to, to save my household things and my mother's uh, 
I purchased a big, huge uh, Miller 400, which is a welder, which is I can use for work as well. But it's strong enough to run my entire house, including my central air and everything. So that's what I ran my house off of that as my backup. Uh, this thing over here, it actually feeds back to energy and I get credits on my bill for that so I'm not wasting anything. I'm not steadily trying to charge batteries that don't need a charge. So to me, doing my ATA stuff, that's just a waste of uh, energy if I'm not doing something with it. So guys, pay, keep, keep an eye out for this. This is coming. Um, a buddy of mine, Average Joe, is going to advertise it through him as well. And I'm actually going to let him pick the winner. I'm not picking the winner. I will ship this on my dime to anywhere in the 48 states. So maybe somebody can use it. And if you want a chance at this, uh, there will be a video coming that you will have to like the video. You will have to comment in the video and subscribe to my channel as well as Average Joe's channel. So this is coming. If you want to go ahead and get on the bandwagon now and get ready for it, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell. And uh, you guys will be ready for the giveaway on that thing. Uh, so like, subscribe, hit the bell. That way you'll know when that video comes out. Be prepared, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Y'all have a good day.